Hi, this is Heather, the Fed Up Foodie, where I inspire busy people who love to cook and bake so that you feel inspired in your kitchen. Today I'll be sharing beef noodle soup that has tender bites of beef and a rich savory broth. This soup is the perfect cozy meal on a cold day. Chuck roast is a tough cut of beef with great flavor that literally melts in your mouth when slow cooked, making it perfect for this soup. Cut the roast into bite-sized pieces and then salt and pepper the pieces. Sear the beef over medium-high heat. You will know the pan is ready when you see the oil shimmering. Remove the beef and saute the onions in the beef drippings. All the crusty brown bits add great flavor to the soup. Now add in the red wine and finish breaking up the browned bits. To the pan, add in crushed or minced garlic, tomato paste, and Worcestershire sauce. Now add in the dried herbs of marjoram, thyme, basil, oregano, and bay leaves. In goes the diced carrots and celery. Stir well, pour the beef broth in, and then add the seared beef back into the pan. The caramelized surface of these beef cubes are going to give this soup an incredible depth of flavor. Now bring the soup to a boil over high heat. Once boiling, lower the heat to the lowest setting, cover the pan, and simmer for about one to one and a half hours. Once the beef is tender, place a large frying pan with one tablespoon of oil over medium high heat, add mushrooms, and cook till they are tender and have lost most of their moisture. Add the cooked mushrooms, diced tomatoes, frozen vegetables, and the last of the broth to the pan and stir well. There are a few ways to cook the pasta. If you're serving a large group of people, go ahead and add eight ounces of pasta at this time and cook until al dente. The other option would be to cook the pasta separately, drizzle with olive oil, serve the noodles into individual portions. This will prevent the noodles from becoming soggy the next day. The soup is wonderful served with cornbread, homemade biscuits, or garlic bread. And if you like this recipe, please follow along for more easy and tasty recipes your family will love.